you are not in Kansas now, Toto. YOLO. Hello everyone, my name is Barbara and I'm here to tell you the most important thing, the most important message of your life. It's not some sort of story. I'm not here to tell you fables or stories. I'm here to tell you the truth about one living God, Jesus Christ, who is the source of life. He's a source of goodness. He's your only source of rescue here on earth. Once upon a time, I met a group of people who told me about Jesus. And like everyone, I had many ideas about Jesus. I thought Jesus was some Catholic invention. I thought that he was a traditional God that was condemning me. I thought that he was a type of God that was trying to put restrictions on my freedoms. I thought he was the type of God that was trying to stop me from having fun. I thought he was the type of God that was trying to limit my freedom and my life. And I was looking for something, for a sense of life, for a meaning of life. I was living in a beautiful country. I had a great life. I finished a degree at a prestigious university. I was diving on coral reef for my holidays. And yet, in my heart, I felt emptiness. I felt a sense of longing, a sense of emptiness. I was looking for a meaning of life. And I started to look for a God. I went everywhere. I went to a Buddhist temple. I visited Hare Krishnas. I was asking about God. I was asking everywhere about this sense of emptiness. And no one and nothing could help me. And then I heard about Jesus. And I couldn't believe that there could be such a person. So simple. I couldn't believe that it could be so simple as to receive a living God into my life. But it is that simple. It is foolishness. It is foolishness that you are ignoring it. It is foolishness, but it is the wisdom of God. And it is the life of God inside Jesus. And when you receive him, a miracle happens. A miracle happens. You are born to a new life, like I was born to a new life. I'm blessed. For blessed is a man whose sins are forgiven. And I'm such a person. My sins are forgiven. I'm blessed. I know one true living God. He lives inside of me. He is with me all the time. I have a deep sense of security. I have a deep sense of peace inside my heart. And I know that there is nothing that can happen in this world that can change it. There is nothing that can take it away from me. That I am one with God. That He, the creator of the universe, is living inside of me. He is one with me. He chose to come on this earth. And He chose to live in every single person that chooses God, that chooses Jesus with his, his or her whole heart. All you need to do is open your heart. All you need to do is bend your knees and say, Jesus, I'm sorry I lived without you. I'm sorry I lived without you. Come into my life. 
I'm giving you my heart. I'm giving you my life. You need to take a step forward and open your heart because he's already done everything. Everything is done. Everything that needed to be done is done. It's not some sort of fable of history. Jesus Christ is a reality. He changes reality. He's a source of life. He can heal any kind of sense of emptiness, any sense of loneliness, any lack of purpose, any kind of depression, any kind of disease. He's here. He's here. The kingdom of God is at hand. If you're hearing me right now, I'm giving you words of life. The choice is yours. Because he has already done everything. The choice is yours. You can choose to have peace. Peace with God. You can choose to bend your knees and bend your neck and say, Jesus, come into my life. And if you do that, and if you declare him your Lord and your King and your Savior, he will come and he will change your life forever. Amen.